Thank you very much for coming to this uh, Congress of uh, Regional Golf Federations. First of all, the President of the Madrid Golf Federation, Ignacio de Barba de Guerras, has the floor. Good morning. Thank you very much for being here with us. And first of all, I want to say in my name or in the behalf of the Madrid Federation of Golf, welcome to this new project of the Madrid Golf Federation. At last, after all these years, we have managed to achieve what all the presidents of regional federations wanted to do, what we had in mind, what we wanted to carry out. We wanted to have some working sessions within the Congress of the federations. I believe that this seminar is a turning point to put uh, ideas, to share ideas, and to work together. The times have changed. Golf has changed. For the last four or five years, we've been living a recession. From here, and as at the beginning of this change, the Golf Federation proposes two pathways, two paths of work. The first one is to identify our players to get to know the problems and identifying the institutions, knowing which paths we can follow, concentrating on the promotion and development of our sport. This second line of work is very important. The project of getting closer to society to the society of golfers and to the society that's not involved in golf. I think that is the path we must follow. And that is why I propose in this seminar to continue working in this direction. We are committed to promotion and to development. The people from the Madrid Federation has tried to bring three speakers, three representatives that can open our eyes, can give us a range of possibilities. We have three different speakers from three different countries, but they are all leaders with their work in their respective countries. First of all, we're going to hear a speaker from the English Golf, Golf Union, the person responsible for the development of golf, both at the club level and at the level of players. Secondly, from the French Federation, we will hear about the development, their efforts, and how they managed to host the Raider camp, the creation of three um, small courses. And finally, from the United States, we're going to hear a person who's very experienced in something where we've been trying to carry out for many years. It's golf in the schools. They have approached 60,000 schools. They have had 375,000 players, 10,000 more than we have now in the whole of Spain. And I would like you to hear with great attention this, listen to these three people. I think they can give us many ideas. They can open a range of possibilities. They can share with us their conclusions, their findings, and we can take advantage of, the presen of their presence. I am not the protagonist here. I will give the floor to them. And this is how we open this seminar.